Hello, my name is Andy Tattersall and this is a Mendeley Masterclass. This one I'm going to show you how to create folders. Folders are the things that appear here on the top left hand corner. Uh, there are various ways that you can navigate and collect your references. One is by tagging them uh, and also by searching via authors and author keywords and publications. But another one which is very useful and more conventional than tagging is to have co uh, conventional folders. Now all your references sit in the folder that is called all documents, that's it, like your master list and you can drag and drop uh, papers into references into uh, multiple folders so they can sit in multiple locations so I can, I can take a reference and I can go and put it in say this folder and I can take that and put it in that folder and it'll, when I open these folders up they'll both be there. If I delete one from a folder then it will still stay in the one that's above and it will still stay in my master list. To create folders, straightforward, just go up here and click create folder and appear, uh, one will appear down here so uh, I will call it uh, test folder um, like so and now I've got my test folder and what I can do is, is I can go to my old folders and I can drag and drop uh, papers into the test folder so if I drag that in there like so you'll now see that that reference appears in that folder. If I delete that reference from that folder, so it's gonna, it wants me to know, do I want to remove, uh, so I just want to remove the uh, reference, that's now gone. But if I go back to my old documents, it's still there. So the only way to get rid of a master document is to delete it from the master list. Uh, so you can put them into subfolders, they can sit in multiple folders. Um, so it's a very, very good way for navigating because sometimes you may obviously use the same reference in multiple locations. What you don't want is multiple references in your database because that would just get confusing. So um, that's folders for you, a useful one to use once you start getting into uh, you know a few hundred references in your collection.